The reason is approach is season is approaching for folks in the Wabash Valley to start thinking about ways to heat their home, and most will turn, of course, to their furnace. Others will try alternative resources or sources, and without the proper use, these appliances can become very dangerous. Demetri Sanders spent some time finding out how folks can be safe this fall and winter, and he joins us now with our top story. Demetri. Thanks, Tom. Alternative heating sources such as space heaters are typically used to save money and to warm small areas. But several precautions must be taken to make sure that the appliances create heat and not headaches. Cooler temperatures are on the way, which means many folks will bring out their space heaters, a home appliance that can cause damage when used incorrectly. Once wintertime hits, space heater fires that are related to either space heaters um, or some type of alternative heating other than your normal furnace, um, we see you know an increase. While the heaters have caused destruction in the past, there are ways to make sure that they don't in the future. They place those throughout their house, and those are fine as long as they're not near combustible material such as uh, sofas and, and curtains and clothes. Paul Davis, a company that focuses on the restoration of buildings after fires, says that you should not only be cautious about the space heater's area, but also the condition of the unit. The main thing is just to make sure it's in proper working order. And so check those cords before you ever plug it in. While it's running, of course, never leave it unattended, never leave it while you're sleeping. The improper use of a space heater can cause much damage to your home, as well as physical harm, such as serious burns if you get too close. Make sure that you try to stay away from it. You don't lean up against it. You don't let a child lean up against it. And if a fire does happen to break out, Sittler says making sure another appliance is in working condition can potentially save your life. We'll make sure you have a working smoke detector. That's one of our biggest things that we want to make sure people have. In addition to safety precautions for electrical heaters, Sittler says kerosene heater fuel should always be kept outside and away from your home. Tom? Really good advice. Thank you, Demetrius. Firefighters also say that sleeping with your door closed can also increase your chances of safely escaping a fire from a heating source.